Hi guys, welcome to the video. Just want to let you know that the mods are in the description, so if you want to try them, please get them, and I hope you find this video useful. So, we're going to download it from the GitHub here, and make sure that you follow how I do it, because that is very important. You open the zip file, and we're going to drag it over into our ships and script folder, like so. I'm not going to install it though, because I've already got it. However, uh, only install these files. You don't need the license and whatnot, and the craft. You can then install the craft into your ships, then VAB. And overwrite it if you have it. We can then go to the settings and change it to how we like. Currently, not all of it is done, but as you're watching this, you may have uh, many updates, so it might be done by the time you are. We're going to use ASDS for this one, the barge landings. And we can go to our landing zones. And if you are using RTLS, you can change these to how you like and add your own. Now we're testing this out, so this is how you do it. You open ship lander here to grab the coordinates once we've separated and just follow how I do it. So we'll separate, switch to stage one and wait for this mission lapse timer in the top left to get to about T plus 30. Turn off the booster CPU and then lock to radial out. By turning off the CPU you stop it from boosting back. Now we wait until that timer is about 30 seconds and then what we're going to do on ship lander is click current. This gets the coordinates, we can change the altitude to land us at to about 50 or 10 and we land so that we go back to the coordinates. We're then just going to drop it and try and smoothly land in the ocean, doesn't matter because we are just going to destroy this craft anyway. Use vessel mover to spawn in the drone ship provided and then you can orient it so it's down on the ground. I'm going to orient it so the text is facing the launch site, similar to how they do it IRL, and place it down. From this we can go to hyper edit and delete the any of the old drone ships that exist and delete any of the launch uh, parts we just sent into space because we don't need those anymore. Please don't set this back as recovery, just go to the space center like I do here. And then what we're going to do is we're going to put it back out on the launch site and we're just going to switch to stage one and watch it land. Currently there's no non boost back mode for a drone ship, it's for precision and accuracy. I will maybe implement that as the entry bend. A bit of wiggling, I'll also fix that. And landing burn. As you can see, pretty good. Uh, and here's stage two, if you're interested in how the launch operations work. As not everyone is interested in landing the boosters, most people like it but some people do like sending stage 2 into orbit and you can see a pretty good burn accurate to the apogee only a few hundred meters off and yeah that is pretty much it guys i hope you've enjoyed the video if you found this helpful please leave us a comment or on anything we can improve also